the industrial park is a very important component of uh, Lake Zurich's economic base. Uh, approximately 75% of our 10 largest employers work within the industrial park and it encompasses nearly 20% or one-fifth of Lake Zurich's land mass. Some of our largest employers are Echo, Termex, Peapod, uh, Smalley Steel Ring, and the jobs that are created and uh, that uh, exist within this industrial park are very important. Approximately 75% of our 10 largest employers work within the industrial park. There are thousands of jobs in the industrial park. Uh, as a matter of fact, Echo, one of our largest employers in the, in the village, just put on a, a multi-million dollar expansion. And if you know Echo, you know that it takes up a big chunk of the industrial park. I've been president of the Lake Zurich Industrial Council for uh, uh, 17 years, and I've been with Echo Incorporated for 18 years. Some of my roles with the uh, Lake Zurich Industrial Council and uh, interacting with the village of Lake Zurich, they've been very positive. We were very pleased that the village reached out to us for our assistance because it showed that they wanted the thoughts and opinions of those that are working here in Lake Zurich to get ideas as to how we could make the zoning code better. It was a, it was a great experience with staff and uh, we made a lot of sweeping changes to the code that allowed businesses to uh, more simply come into the park. We opened up more permitted uses and more permitted uses allows you to uh, streamline your entry into the into the village. You don't need to have uh, reviews from the uh, village board. You don't need to have reviews with the, the Zoning and Development Committee. So it, it, it reduces your time to permit. Here at ECHO, I've had the opportunity to work with uh, the village board on several building expansion projects. Uh, in my time with ECHO, I've built uh, two distribution centers and most recently, a corporate office expansion. During our corporate office expansion, we met with the village staff prior to permitting just to review the scope of the project and what it was that ECHO wanted to accomplish on our property. And staff was very excited that ECHO chose to expand here in Lake Zurich and worked with us to offer suggestions as to uh, uh, how we could uh, reduce our time to permit as well as uh, offer uh, design suggestions for us that uh, would give us a better product uh, and more durable product you know throughout the years and we appreciated that type of cooperation and, uh, and partnership as well. Since our building project was an industrial project in an, in an industrial zoning district we were able to get our project approved administratively. That saved us you know, months of uh, formal meeting time with the different boards, as well as the costs associated with uh, applying to uh, those various boards and preparing materials for those meetings. So we really appreciated them uh, opening up that administrative process for, for ECHO's project. And in the end, we have a beautiful building that uh, uh, everybody is, uh, is happy to see built in Lake Zurich. In addition to that, we've got uh, Smalley Ring, which uh, also two years ago put on a, a big, huge expansion. So we've got a lot of interesting businesses in the industrial park.